वेलकम टू मेडिसिन बाई चिप्स टूडेज अवर टॉपिक ऑफ डिस्कशन इज द मयरमेंट ऑफ बॉडी टेम्परेचर फॉर द मयरमेंट ऑफ बॉडी टेम्परेचर वी यूज क्लिनिकल थर्मामीटर सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी विल स्टडी द फीचर्स ऑफ क्लिनिकल थर्मामीटर लेट्स डिस्कस द फीचर्स ऑफ थर्मामीटर इट कंटेन अ मर्क्री बल्ब एंड द ट्यूब बिटवीन द मर्क्री बल्ब एंड द ट्यूब इज द किंक विच प्रिवेंट्स द मर्क्री इन द कैपिलरी ट्यूब फ्राम फॉलिंग बैक द मर्क्री बल्ब कंटेन्स द मर्क्री द ट्यूब हैज the readings on it uh, on one side they are in celsius scale while on the other side they are in fahrenheit scale uh, the normal body temperature which is 37 degree celsius are uh, 1098.6 fahrenheit it is pointed by an arrow uh, this arrow it is pointed by an arrow on the uh, bulb so uh, when the temperature uh, rises when the temperature rises uh, the mercury column in the thermometer rises and it will move away from the mercury bulb uh, now i have explained the features of the th thermometer now we will discuss the methods by which we measure the temperature of the body there are generally three methods by which we uh, measure the temperature of the body the one is uh, through mouth the second is through axilla and the third one is through rectal region the first two, uh, the first two are most common uh, commonly used experiments in the first one we will ask the subject to place it below the tongue uh, and uh, hold it uh, between the lips instead of teeth and ask him to take the breath through nose uh, after placing the thermometer below the tongue we will uh, uh, ask the patient to hold it for one or two minutes after that we will remove the thermometer and check the rise in the mercury column which will predict the temperature of the body the second method is by axillary region in this we will ask the subject to place it uh, in axilla against the uh, arm of the body uh, and uh, place it for 1 to 2 minutes after that we will remove it and uh, again measure the rise in the mercury column uh, and that will predict the temperature of the body the third method is the rectal method which is not commonly used but uh, sometimes used in babies uh, in this we will place it in rectum and uh, remove it after 1 or 2 minutes and measure the temperature of the body for this we will first of all take consent from our subject so let's uh, uh, start our experiment assalamu alaikum my name is dr arslan mahmood uh, i will uh, check your body temperature i will uh, you have to place this thermometer uh, in your axillary region for 1 or 2 minutes it will not cause any harm to you after 1 or 2 minutes i will you will uh, remove it from me and give remove it from your axillary region and give it to me and i will check your body temperature by measuring the mercury column uh, do you agree uh, let's place it in your axillary region uh, now we will ask the patient to remove it from the axillary region and we will check the rise in the mercury column that will move against the mercury bulb and uh, the temperature of our subject is uh, 98.2 fahrenheit that is approximately normal uh, because the normal body temperature is 37 degree celsius uh, but uh, when the temperature of the body rises the condition is known as hyperthermia the optimum value for hyperthermia is uh, 104 degree fahrenheit uh, degree fahrenheit or 40 degree celsius and uh, the other uh, opposite condition in which is known as hypothermia in which the body of the temperature falls uh, down uh, the optimum value for hypothermia is uh, 95 degree fahrenheit or 35 degree celsius so we will uh, today we have performed the experiment that how to check the temperature of the body by using a clinical thermometer thanks for watching the, our video uh, subscribe our youtube channel and share it with your friends